grade lesson 36 language. All right, so today, um, go ahead and open your language books. Open them to page 39. And uh, put your name and date at the top of that page. You can pause the video while you do so. All right, so at the top of page 39, you're going to draw a line from the month to its abbreviation. Place a period at the end of each abbreviation. Remember that some months do not have abbreviations. But you also have to remember that here is January. When we abbreviate January, it is not just J-A-N. The abbreviation is J-A-N period. So be sure and place your abbreviation, your periods after your abbreviations or they will not be correct, okay? And then think B, it says write the abbreviation for each day of the week. Place a period at the end. So for your days of the week as well. Sunday, here's our day of the week, Sunday, our first day of the week. And when we write the abbreviation, capital S-U-N, period. So you have to remember your capital letter and your period on your abbreviations, okay? All right, so go ahead and look at Remember C. It says read the paragraph, circle each common noun, and draw a box around each proper noun. So remember, those proper nouns are going to name. They're going to have capital letters on them. They're going to name a particular person, a particular place, or a particular thing, okay? Guess I can bring y'all back up closer now. All right, so let's begin reading. Alaska is the largest state in the United States. We have one common noun in there. What is it? State. And we have two proper nouns. So you're going to circle your common noun state, and we're going to box our proper nouns. Alaska is a proper noun. Put a box around it. And United States is a proper noun. Put a box around it. Very good. Alaska does not touch any of the other states. We have a proper noun that is Alaska, put a box around it, and one common noun, and that is states. Let's circle it, very good. It is next to the country of Canada. We have one common noun, country, circle it, and the proper noun is Canada, put a box around it. Alaska has many long days in the summer and many short days in the winter. So we have a proper noun at the beginning of our sentence. What is it? Alaska, put a box around it. Then we have four common nouns. Days, summer, days, winter. Those are our common nouns. Um, the town of Barrow, Alaska has 67 days with no sun at all. So we have three common nouns in there. Town, circle it, days, and sun. Good job. And we have two proper nouns. Barrow, that's the name of the city. And Alaska is the name of the state. Very good. Put boxes around them. Can you imagine 67 days that seem like only night? Woo, I could not imagine that. So we have two common nouns in there. Days and night. Circle them. Children go to school, eat their lunches, and even play at recess in the dark. So we don't have any, any proper nouns. You might say, yeah, but children is capitalized. It is capitalized, but are we talking about a particular child? No, it's only capitalized because it's the first word in the sentence, okay? So children is a common noun, school, lunch, recess, and dark. Those are all people, places, or things. In the summer, Barrow, Alaska has 80 days with little or no darkness. So we have four, or three, three, prop, or three common nouns. What do we have? Summer days and darkness and two proper nouns barrow and alaska very good remember we're boxing the proper circling the comma children must go to bed and sleep when it is still daylight three common nouns children bed and daylight what an interesting place to live one common noun what is it 
place. Very good. That is your language for today. Go ahead and complete all of page 36. Page 39, not 36, sorry, page 39.